As of October 7, 2021, the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs has recorded a total of 11,890 confirmed cases of COVID-19. The commencement of the current fourth wave has been approximated to be around July 25, 2021, and since then, over 6,000 cases have been diagnosed, with an average of 87 cases daily. There are currently 1,159 active cases. An estimated 35% of infections are asymptomatic, and this is not always possible to determine who is infected. It is therefore important that we do not drop our guard and continue to make safe choices. As contact tracing efforts continue, the Ministry of Health appeals to the public to adhere to the established protocols in order to reduce further transmission to family, friends, and other loved ones. Individuals who present signs and symptoms of COVID-19, as well as those who have been identified as contacts, are asked to get tested at the nearest respiratory clinic and to remain in quarantine until receipt of your results. Once someone tests positive for COVID-19, a contact tracer is assigned to that individual. Contact will be made with the individual to inform of the positive results and to collect data on exposure and contacts, as well as to provide guidance on testing and ways to keep your family safe. Please note that contact is made based on the information provided at the testing site. It is therefore imperative that persons accessing testing services provide the healthcare provider with active telephone numbers and in the case where a telephone number of a next of kin is provided, that the individual is informed of this and has means of making contact with you. The contact tracing team continues to encounter difficulties in reaching persons as they have provided telephone numbers that are inactive or have provided that of a next of kin who has no means of contacting them. As we continue to work together to address this pandemic, the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs ask the public to continue practicing the standard recommendations to prevent the spread of infection. These include regular hand washing with soap and water, use of alcohol-based hand sanitizer if soap and water are unavailable, proper use of face masks, cleaning and disinfecting frequently touched surfaces, and maintaining physical distance. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs thanks the public for its continued support and will continue to provide updates on the COVID-19 situation on island. <music>